All right, guys, what's going on? And welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Sun and Moon playthrough. Hopefully, you guys are having yourselves a great day today. And if you do want to go ahead and show your support to the episode, make sure you go ahead and drop a like down below. Of course, your support is greatly appreciated. So here we are in Aether Paradise because... Honestly, I have no idea what this episode has in store for us. All I know is that our boy Gladion wants him, uh, we gotta follow him or something. How is here for some reason? And we got a squadron. We definitely have a squadron. So let's go over our squad really quickly. Of course, we have our starter Incineroar, Delta the Lycanroc, Toxicity the Toxapex who actually evolved last episode. Look at this guy. Then we have Cassius the Sandygast, Pajama the Lurantis, and Jade the Oricorio. So that is what we're rocking out with. And I'm pretty sure this episode's this episode's about to be pretty epic. It, that's, that's just what it seems like, honestly. I, I don't know why else we would be here, so let's just go ahead and head up the uh, elevator here. Do we have to touch the thing? I have no idea what we're doing. I have no idea. I guess our boy Gladion knows how to work the elevator. Huh, just like I thought. I, okay, maybe he doesn't. Uh, looks like the outsiders can't use the main elevator to reach the lower levels. I was afraid this might happen, but still, what a pain. We don't have any choice, so we'll have to go up. Oh, I guess he does know how to work the elevator. All right, cool. So where are we to now? Where are we to? I'm Faba. I'm the Aether Branch Chief. The only one in the world. I'm irreplaceable. And here you come back, uninvited, like you don't know why. You of all people should know everything that happens in the Aether Foundation. Isn't that right, high and mighty Branch Chief? Kiki, look at you. Living out in the world hasn't been kind, has it? But I'm still not telling you anything. And you of all people should understand why, Gladion. Hey, Supra. You know why being a trainer is so great? Because you're battle. Uh, because when you're battling, it doesn't matter if you're a kid or an adult. Everyone's equal in a Pokemon battle. That's true. That's true. Oh ho, is that right? Is that what you think? So you wish to battle me? Branch Chief Faba, the man who was called Aether Paradise's last line of defense uh, is to a battle a mere child? As you will. Alright, let's go, boy. Let's go. Branch Chief Faba. You got an ugly name, bro. Faba. That's that's disgusting. Honestly, I would not want to be you, buddy. Alright, but this dude honestly looks like an insect. I don't know if you guys can see. So what's it what's he gonna have? A hip. A... Really? Really? All bark, no bite. Okay, so honestly, we can just malicious moonsault this thing in the forehead, and it's gonna be dead in a second. This this is gonna be disgusting. This is gonna be an absolute slaughter fest. Okay, never mind. <laughs> never mind, never mind, never mind. That's actually very annoying. Not too happy about that one. Not too happy about that. But how do we not outspeed a hypno? That's what I wanna know. Are we really that slow? Because Hypno is not fast. I know it's not the fact that Hypno is just faster than I think it is. I think it's just that we think Incineroar, or I think Incineroar is a lot faster than Oh, look at that play. All right, so um, I'm just going to go for it again. Maybe he'll miss Hypnosis. Maybe he won't go for Hypnosis. Okay, definitely. Definitely not one of those options. What do we do? I think we just have to wait until he either misses or until... I don't know. If that was me, I would have missed both of those hypnosis. So I don't know what's going on right now. I really don't. I'm just going to heal up again. Maybe he'll go for Nightmare. I mean, he can't attack me with the Psychic move. We are a Dark type, so I guess this is really our only option. This is really the only option we have. So, well, let's just move Salt. Let's do it. Hey, look at that. Okay, so he finally missed, and we're able to hit this thing. And this should do a truckload. So before this episode, I made sure um, I, I, I went for a hunt. And I went to find a new team member to replace Oricorio. Now, if you haven't been keeping up, uh, we do want Drampa on the team. Drampa is just, unfortunately, you find it too late in the game. And I want to at least use it a little bit before we take on the Elite Four and stuff. I think that's very understandable. Um, so I, I was looking, and I decided that we have a couple options that I think would be pretty cool for the team. One of them is Oranguru. Oranguru would be really cool. I would honestly rather Passimian, but we're playing Pokemon Moon instead of Sun. So we can't use it. Um, but you can find a Ranguru in this game, and, you know, it, re it would replace a Psychic type for a Psychic type, so that would be cool. Hold on, let me read this dialogue really quickly. Hopefully I don't forget what I'm talking about. I probably will, but how could this be? How could this child? Ah, oh, look at you, Supra. And Faba is real strong, too. Hello? We just completely murked him. So, as I said, Faba, you of all people should know what I'm here for. Indeed. The world truly hasn't been kind to you, has it? Look how hard it has made you. If you're looking for Cosmog, I suppose it might be downstairs. Downstairs? Oh yes, Miss Wiki did say that there was another level farther down. Wait, weren't you trying to go down there? You would already know 
where that was, we were trying- okay, whatever. Well, if you must know, I've heard experiments are held down there. Experiments aiming to tear the very boundaries of the world apart. Oh, we're in a bit of a hurry, Faba. A lift would be nice. Why not? This is an act of kindness I can do for you thanks to my position as branch chief. Okay, I don't really understand that logic, but hey man, thanks for helping us to destroy your company. I guess, super how. If you're ready, let's head down. All right, let's go. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's do it, boys. All right, let's go. So yeah, a Rangaroo would be cool. Another Pokemon I'm considering is Minior, just because that'd be really fun to use. I really like Minior, and he's also pretty good. He might have taken us... Why do I feel like he took us to a, a different level than we're supposed to go to? Everything looks the same. I guess it's only been two years, though. Wow, it's like a secret hideout. Don't get excited, Hal. Though, I guess it's better than freezing from fear or nerves. So where do we go now? There are two labs ahead. I'll check the first one, Secret Lab A. You guys check Secret Lab B. Alright, uh, just focus, Hal. Think you can do that? We can't trust Faba. Alright, so, yeah, I don't know. He had that little smirk on his face. Why do I feel like that? Maybe he sent us to a different level than we're supposed to go to? And this is a trap or something? I have no idea. But alright, so this man is checking Secret Lab B, I do believe, right? So this is probably the one we're supposed to go to. No? This one? I, I don't really know where to go. Yep, okay, probably this one. But, yeah, Mini War would be cool. Another Pokemon I'm considering is Alolan Sandslash. That would be a pretty cool Pokemon to use. Um... Let's see, uh, there's there's a couple more that I'm like, eh, I mean, I guess. But there's nothing I was for sure decided on. Oh, Jangmo, and we could use uh, Hakamo and then uh, Komo, and that would be really cool. And I think that's probably the one we're gonna go with if nothing changes. Oh, Comfy also, Comfy, Comfy. That, that would be a really cool Pokemon to use. It's really fast for some reason. It's got like base 100 speed, right? And um, it's got like 110 special defense and like 90 or 80 uh, special attack. So that's very interesting. One second, let me check something really quickly on my computer. Um, we're good. I got the little uh, thing on DXTory, which is my recording software, that said uh, check your storage, and we are 110% good to finish out the episode. So don't worry there, no worries. But what do we want to do against this thing? It's Poison Dark, correct? Poison Dark. So I might just go to Cassius and go for Bulldoze. Um, I don't know what else we would go for, I really don't. Maybe I'm completely forgetting we have a move or something. And when we do have exit, ooh. That's really bad. That is really bad. And unfortunately we can't poison this thing or else that'd be the first option I'd go to. Definitely. Damn, this thing's actually a threat. All right, let's try Lycanroc. That really sucks. He predicted me hardcore on that. And not only, like he knocked off a really good item too. Crunch. Yeah, we're good. All right. Um, let's try out Rock Slide. Let's try it out. Okay, I'm happy with it. Can we get a flinch? Maybe. Ooh, and that's gonna knock off the Hard Stone. So I don't know if this next one will kill. Let's see. Let's see if it will. I love that animation. It's so cool. Ugh, so close. Flinch. Yeah. Let's freaking go. Nice job. Alright, we'll just go for a brick break now because I don't want to miss, but... Nice! There we go! Good job, Lycan Rock. You, did, you, you really came through there with that flinch. Perfect. Thank God you get your items back after battle, because if I just lost an Eviolite and a Hearthstone... Well, the Hearthstone's not that bad, but if I lost an Eviolite, I would have been livid. Absolutely livid. Do I have to take on all these guys or just one? Uh, they are the only researcher... Uh, wait. Wait, up ahead I see Gladion. But didn't Gladion say to, he was going to go to a different one? I don't know. Or maybe that's not Gladion I see up ahead. I don't know. It really looked like Gladion. It really did. Maybe if they, uh, after this battle, I'll show you guys what I mean. He was in the top right or something. I don't know. It just looked like his outfit. So I'm assuming it was him. But hey, maybe it wasn't. Maybe it wasn't. All right. Uh, I don't think going for Malicious Moonsault is going to matter. Because he does have Sturdy. Probably. He probably has Sturdy. All of these things always have sturdy, so maybe we can just get a flinch or something. Yep, there's the sturdy. And... Oh! Yo! Not even bad. So we got the turn one kill. 
instead because she's gonna die from burn hey and burn actually got crazy nerfed because uh I, I mentioned it before i mentioned it a lot actually i just love talking about it um i do really like playing competitive battling for this meta like the sun and moon meta is so fun and burn got nerfed hella man like if you're holding leftovers and you got burned you just take your burn damage and then immediately get the health back with leftovers normally you would get like uh, like half of the amount of burn damage back from leftovers because burn actually did like double damage I'm pretty sure or double it did uh, from this generation but um now it does only half that and you just get it all back and it's crazy and like you may think it wouldn't matter but that actually matters a lot in Porygon 2 okay com in competitive Porygon Z it has a Z move a uh, Z conversion I'm pretty sure the move is just regular conversion uh, but it's the Z move form of that and it's ridiculous. You d it boosts like all your stats and if this thing pulled that out, I don't think we'd be able to win. I honestly don't. It's scary as hell, man. It really is. But all right, let's go Incineroar. Let's get him. Malicious Moonsault. I think the Z move names are absolutely hilarious. What is the Snorlax one? Pulverizing Pancake or something? It's hilarious. I don't know how they think of these names. I really don't. Hey. I don't know if that'll kill, actually. Wow. I'm very surprised. I mean, it is Stab. I'm not really sure what the base power is, but hey. I will take it. And there we go. First Pokemon to level 40. Everyone's leveling up really fast now. Definitely not complaining. Definitely 100%. 110% not complaining. I like leveling up as much as the next guy. Alright. And I think that, yeah, that's all these guys. Uh, but I'm not good at battling, so I'm out of here. See ya. Adios, bro, chachos. And, uh, what are you... <laughs> yeah, yeah, I get it. No rush. <laughs> no rush. He's like, yeah, whatever. Alright, so let's just heal up real quick, like... We bought these things, right? Yeah, okay, good, thank god. Yeah, I kind of remember going on a small little shopping spree last episode and buying a bunch of items, but... Wasn't really sure. Maybe it was a dream. Maybe it could have been a dream, because typically I do dream about buying items at the Pokemart, right? It's definitely what I dream about. All right, let's put Delta up front because I, I don't know. I just want to use Delta. And uh, let's continue. Am I right? Gladion is up here? Yeah, there's Gladion. Oh, this is just where the labs are. It's not here. Okay, so it's just going to be this next lab up here. Uh, we were more alike than we might look. Hmm. All right, dude. So we got to go this way then. I'm assuming this is the lab. Oh, there's a Zygarde core right there. Should probably pick that up. Of course, there's going to be a freaking cutscene as soon as I get in here, but hey. I missed that Zygarde cube, God damn it. Whoa, whoa, what are you kids doing in here? What is how doing? <laughs> this research is our life. Alright, yeah, well, he just walked and he's like, eh, what, why, why are you doing this? And he's just up against the wall, <laughs> like. I love that logo, it looks so cool. Oh, it's so that, wait, do we get to play with how here? Or is it just solo? Is it a solo double battle? Vanillish and choke. All right, let's get him. I'm just gonna go for Rock Slide, and it's pro it's not gonna do anything to the choke, but maybe we'll get a kill or some. I mean, not kill a uh, flinch. It'll kill the Vanillish probably. And oh my God, this FPS drop! Please kill the choke. Good job, Raichu. I'm not gonna write you a love song. Just to ask for it, cause you need one. That was really easy, wow. For people that research for their life, you would think that they had better Pokemon, I don't know. All right, so Cassius grew to level 39, and Pajama grew to 40, ooh. See, as much as I love to teach you Sweet Scent, see, as much as I love to teach you Sweet Scent. Another world that cannot be brought about through idle talk. Guide it, guide it, hello? Got it. I don't know how the hell I pronounced that word or mispronounced that word. I may be an expert at studying Pokemon, but I'm no expert when it comes to battling them. Fair enough. Fair enough. Hey, focus, people. Uh, where's Lily and Cosmog? We may have lost. Uh, we may have lost, but that doesn't mean we're going to help you. I'm not telling you anything. She's not here, is she? Even you can see that. And then they just leave. It's so weird. Come on, Super. Let's split up and look around. Okay, so I remember earlier in the LP, I mentioned, I don't know, when we first met Team Aether, I was like, is Team Aether a bad team? Are they a good team? And 
I don't know, man. They kidnapped a girl and they want to do some experiments. I'm I'm just gonna go ahead and assume that huh, I need to read this probably. Uh Ultra Beast that hails from another dimension. Huh. Manipulate the ultra wormholes. Alright. So Cosmog might be an Ultra Beast. We should tell Gladion. Yeah, we probably should. But yeah, I think Team uh, Team Aether is probably an evil team. I don't know. I, maybe there's two evil teams. Maybe Team Skull is actually a good team. I, I have no idea what's going on right now. All right, what's up, Gladion? Did you find anything? We learned a bit about Cosmog. Like, it might be an Ultra Beast or whatever. And if you stress it a lot, I can uh, I can create Ultra... Uh, it can create Ultra Wormholes. Maybe to run away or something. If you stress it. If you hurt it. Is that what you mean? Was that why she ran away with it? But we didn't have any sign of it down here. Yeah, Faba probably knew this would be a dead end. Yeah, darn, did he outsmart us? Okay, see, that's what that little smirk was about. Gladion never really did explain anything. Uh, or he never really explains anything. Probably thinks it makes him look cool. No, it makes him look like a freaking dickweeb. I don't know what's going on at all. All right, uh, do we go in here? I want to check it out. Let's in here. Let's see. Doesn't look like anything prob- ooh. That's helpful. I'll take it. What's this blue book? File 2. Hentai you be fighting life form. Whoa. Alright. That's, uh, that's interesting. Interesting deleted files. I wonder if those are the same deleted files as the other, uh, lab room, but hey. Whatever, let's just go in here. See what Gladion has to say. Are we going upstairs or... Where are we going? In here? In here? Where is everyone? Where do they go? Do we just go upstairs? It seems weird that they would go without me though, so... I don't know. Maybe we gotta go to the observatory at some point, I don't know. Supra. What's up, bro? Humph. Even being down, old Fama doesn't change, does he? Uh, what do we do? Uh, beat whoever stands in our way. What other choice do we have? Fine, fine. We can do that, but do you have to say humph all the time? It's a good point. Oh, hello? Hello, children. I'm afraid Branch Chief Faba has given us orders regarding you three. Now that you learned all the darkness and heart of Aether Paradise, we'll need you all to conveniently disappear. Whoa, Supra, battle with me. Well, whatever you say, homeboy. Whatever you say, homeboy. Let's battle with the boy how. Alright, what are these guys gonna have? Are they gonna have the same weak stuff as last time? Mudsdale? Okay. That is threatening. A Mudsdale. Uh, Mudsdale is actually a really... He's pretty scary and competitive. I normally can deal with him pretty easily, but... They always try to switch in and get their stamina right, and then... I don't know. It... I've only seen one Mudsdale with rest, but Mudsdale with rest is very, very scary. You get it so low, and then he's just like, back to full. Ooh. I really wish he attacked the Mudsdale there, but you know what? It's okay. Just means the Pelper will 100% die this turn, uh, but this sucks because Mudsdale is going to get stamina. Oh, maybe it's own tempo. Maybe it's an own tempo, Mudsdale. Ah. Oh! Fortunately, it's not, but hey. It's okay. I don't think we're going to you know, have too much trouble with this Mudsdale, especially if Raichu just wants to Psychic it. Maybe we'll flinch it. Because uh, if he goes for high horsepower or something... Ooh! That's really good. Finally, we get an awesome move like Crunch. Sweet. Sweet. I was wondering if we were going to get Night Slash or Crunch or something anytime soon. Yep, we're dead. Or you're dead, I should say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, send out Decidueye. That's fine. That is completely fine. I'll just go for Crunch, and then if you want to go for, like, Surf or something, homie, homeboy, homie, homie. I probably should have went... I probably should have not attacked it, honestly. How much will this do? Come on. Oh, so close, man. So close. It's just raising his stamina, too. If you go for high horsepower on me, I'm going to be salty. Thank you. Damn, dude, he just has How's number right now. He just wants to... Beat up how? I right, definitely don't think this will kill. Just can I mean he is plus three. Wow, that actually did kill. I am honestly surprised. I think I'm overestimating how good this thing is. All right, I mean we could have had our own Mudsdale. We really could have. We could have just um, 
Used our homie Mudbray. Actually thinking about it, if we wanted to swap out Palisand and Sandy Gast, or I guess it's just one of them, Palisand, we could swap out Palisand, bring in Mudbray or Larry, and then use Oricorio Sensu. But unfortunately, I really want to use Palisand. Unfortunately, that'd be really uh, convenient. Looks like maybe you were right. All right, well, I probably should have listened to where we're supposed to go. Oh, Wiki, young master. Hello? What? What? You want to just battle me or something? I don't, I don't know what's going on right now. We're probably gonna have to battle her. Probably. What do you mean, young master? It's been a long time. Wait, hello? And hello to you too, Super and How. Please let me to heal your Pokemon. Young Master? What's happened to Lily? Do you know something? I imagine she is with the president. Uh, that's what I. Uh, that's where I'm going. That's all I need to know. The president? That's Miss Lusamine, right? She's a really nice person, so I'm sure she'll listen to us if we explain everything. Yeah, she's real nice, as long as you mean nothing to her. <clears throat> but I'm afraid the doors have been locked. Again? That's not stopping me. Welp. So apparently you don't have to heal Wiki. Apparently Wiki is a nice person. But that's so weird. They call Gladion the master. Well, I mean, I, that doesn't, that's not that bad. It's not that bad that he's the master, so it's whatever. All right. <clears throat> my, my, what naughty children. But I knew that you would struggle onward. I could see through every action you would take. So I knew you would try to reach the president. And that is why I knew that I would be able to ambush you here and remedy my uh, previous failure. The only reason I let you in the sh uh, lo shower, I almost said shower, the lower floor was to buy time to gather more staff to stop you. So, uh, Mr. Faba, do you have the key to the president's rooms? Indeed, I have it right here. Okay, give it to me. So if you just stay hidden, we would have been stuck here anyway, right? What? Wait. Enough, you lot. Teach these children a lesson. We don't have time for this, Supra. Or we don't have time for this. Help me out, Supra. Alright, wait. What What was that? What did they how even say? Like, I read it, but I didn't really interpret it. Alright, well, let's just take him on. Let's just take him on. Magmar and Electabuzz. Okay, that's a pretty cool... Pretty cool team. Alright. Let's take them on. Golbat and Delta. I'm just gonna go for a Rock Slide. I mean, it'll definitely kill the Magmar. Well, it should kill the Magmar. I don't know about the Electabuzz, but... Let's see. I really wish Gladion sent out his Type Null. Oh well. That'd just be really cool to see Type Null next to me. Come on. He could've went for the... Oh. And of course you kill the thing or try to kill the thing that I could get. That's what you get, man. That's what you get for not helping me. Boom. I hope this will kill the Electabuzz. Pretty close. Pretty freaking close. Alright. Yeah, now we got a burn Golbat. Nice. I'll just go for Rock Slide because I really don't want to get staticked. Otherwise, I, you know, I see that Crunch is probably better because, you know, we wouldn't miss, but I don't want to get static. Maybe I'll just let him do all the... Wow. I actually did nothing. Actually did nothing. Alright, lit. We did it. We did it. Now I may see him. Oh, we did it. So now do we get the key to the president's room, or is that for later? Is that for later? Let's see. And they just leave. How can this be? To be cornered by mere children. Maybe helping one other is not too bad. Super how? I leave Faba to you. Alright, let's, let's fuck him up. Enough, I will show you the true power. Wait, dude, we already battled you. You got cooked. Come on, Supra. He's not impressed at all. He's just like, bro. Bro. Are you serious, bro? Bro. Alright. Let's get him. Slow, bro. How? 
How did this man randomly get a slow bro? He had a hypno last time. All right, whatever. I mean, I'm just gonna go for a rock slide. I don't know how much it'll do because, you know, slow bro is pretty bulky, but maybe, I mean, it'll kill the Ledian for sure, but I highly, I highly doubt this Raichu is gonna actually try to attack the slow bro and do anything useful, right? Yep, he's just gonna psych the Ledian. I knew it. You probably got Thunderbolt, bro. I don't know what you're doing. And see, now your chances are ruined because he's just gonna... Dude, I just freaking, freaking love how is Alolan Raichu, man. I just love how he helps us out all the time. It's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. Definitely not sarcasm. Toxicity's level 40. Awesome. Really? Really? That would have been really nice to get the flinch, because then we wouldn't be in this situation. Alright. And you keep going for sight. Okay. I don't, I don't know if maybe that's your only attacking move, bro, but like, you gotta understand, it doesn't work like that. Oh. My. Gosh. Alright, um. Let's go to pajama. Let's go to pajama. Alright, what's up? Dude, do you not have Thunderbolt? That's that's actually crazy if you don't. Ooh, I was gonna say if he predicted my switch and went for Yawn and the Lorantis, I was I honestly would have cried. I would have been quite salty. All right, let's get him. Come on, speed it up. Boom. All right, so who's gonna send it now? Uh, I'm assuming you'll still have his Hypno, right? I mean, that just makes sense. That would just make sense, and, uh... Yeah, see, there's the hip now. Right, I'm just gonna go for Leech Life on this thing. I don't think it'll kill, but... Should do a decent amount of damage. I could've went for Bloom Doom, and Bloom Doom probably would've just killed. But, let's go for Leech Life. Let's see how much this will do. Psychic. Uh, we will get some HP back, so that's nice. But do I know how much? Nope. Ooh! Damn, if we ever want to, we can just give Pajama the big root, and then we'll get so much health back from uh, Leech Life. That'd be really awesome, actually. We just eat up everything. If we get, get, like... Are there any physical grass moves that give you health back? I'm not sure. Oh. My. Gosh. Of course. Of freaking course. And I think he finally used the electric move. So thanks for using it on uh, the wrong Pokemon. Really appreciate it, Raichu. Really appreciate it. And I don't like how the status conditions, like, it flickers. And I always, like, I look at my Pokemon and I'm like, hey, he's not asleep. And then it flicks back and I'm like, oh dang it. <laughs> I'm like, shh, crap. All right. Rams, you go to 41. Sick. So do I have the option to switch out now or no? Yeah, he just throws it in, okay. Bruxish? I think this thing's pure water, right? Is it poison type? Let's see. It's not poison type. What type is this thing? Okay. It took me a couple seconds to absorb what just happened. Like, this man just got messed up. Yeah, what is this thing? It's definitely water, right? But it resisted... A psych move. Hey, look at my boy Decidueye. Oh, he's so cool. Holy cr- Oh yeah, it has strong jaw, that's why. Okay, look at that. Yeah, I wonder what type that thing is. Oh well. I mean, I could look it up, but I don't really care. I'll just figure it out eventually. I'll probably figure it out right after this, actually. Alright. Yeah, but dude, that thing has strong jaw, so that did a crazy amount of damage. Crazy. Alright, see ya, dude. I want to help save Lily, so I'm going ahead. You don't mind, right? Well, of course he minds, but like... Why are you so happy, bro? Stop being happy. <laughs> Alright. Thanks for the key, Mr. Faba. <laughs> this is why. This is why I can't bring myself to like children. Alright. Well, here we are. All right, let's go for a hyper po- Oh, we don't need a hyper potion. 
Apparently we got healed by someone, by something. It's not toxicity. Get him a level or two. I mean, toxicity can pretty much kill anything as long as it's not a steel type. As long as it's not a steel type, we pretty much got it on lock. The heck is this? Guzma? <laughs> what is going on right now? Whoa, there's like an Uku billion Team Skull things in this place. So the foundation really was working together with Team Skull. Oh. This is like way too mind blowing to think about. All right, so I'm assuming we got to go through this whole area filled with Team Skull grunts. Reminds me of the Nugget Bridge in um, Pokemon Red and stuff. I just want to see what we got over here. Oh, look at that. Saga Cube. That's actually kind of what I was looking for. I figured they'd probably try to hide one here or there. Uh, let's see if they are hiding any other items. Oh, we actually can't go up here. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Let's see if they're hiding anything over here. Maybe a TM or something. That's what I was also kind of looking for. I don't know. It seems like a cool place to hide one. Let's see. Item a full nice. <laughs> Freaking cool, man. Best item in the game. So I think I'm actually just gonna go ahead and wrap up today's episode right here. And next episode, we will start it off by starting this team skull bridge grunt thing. I don't even know. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Next episode is gonna be completely epic. I can already feel it. So thank you all for watching, like I said, and I will see you all next time. Peace out.